Hey everyone, Surreal Canine here. Welcome back for more to Sky 3 Absence of Detention. Excuse me while I get myself comfortable. <laughs> this beanbag, I'm telling you. Okay, here we go. In the last episode, we unlocked Mal's hidden potential in the form of a special attack, Vasa Air Gun. It has a range of up to four tiles away, it hits in an X shape, its power is D, which is pretty good for a non-post-game material. We definitely want to keep using Mao in the future, that's for sure. Or that would be the case if we didn't have Commander Video! Anyway, it's time to head on into the Heart Vault. The light. Yes, it's the superhero. I heard he had gone missing. Superhero? From about like 200 years ago. I can't believe it! The rarest of the rares! Give me your autograph, please! <laughs> Demon maniac! <laughs> Where is the strongest overlord? Superhero, huh? What's wrong, Mal? Why the scary face? Are you scared? It's the missing trauma resident. How disgusting! The things you find in your heart. You know something. But what's it have to do with Sir Aura? Never mind that, Mal. Er, Almas, it's pushing Mal off the deep end. I would know. Must defeat his shadow. Where is the strongest overlord? He keeps saying the same thing. What's wrong with him? The strongest overlord can only mean one person. Mao's father, our reigning overlord. Strongest overlord. You're so annoying, saying the same thing over and over. I wonder if the title of Mao's father is literally Strongest Overlord. That would be a thing. <laughs> is you. Actually, wouldn't that also be Zeta, though? Because, I mean, Zeta's pretty dang powerful. What's with this guy? Mao's just the Overlord's son. Zeta starts his game at, like, level 2000. Uh, Mal's father is like 1200 at his He's a weirdo finest. who gets excited about experiments. He's not even popular. He's no overlord, <laughs> trust me on this one. She's right. If Sir Mal were a dangerous overlord, I would have stabbed him in the back long ago. <laughs> Princess, don't, don't dirty your hands. Let me do that for you. Thanks for the support, guys. I thought you guys were trying to open up my heart. I'm gonna seclude myself now. You're the strongest overlord. You! You! I'll make you pay for this. <laughs> Meet Superhero Aurum. He has a move called Demon Slayer X. We saw this in the uh, opening, didn't we? Strongest hero from the human world, MIA, for the past 200 years. Increased stats by 3% per enemy unit on the map. It is in your interest, therefore, to solo him. And he's only level 46, so that shouldn't even be that hard, should it? Who knows.
He is a monster type, evidently. So, I don't know what I'm really looking for, trying to find his weapon affinities. Let's just take him out. Got a cleric, a, uh, a witch, brawler, and a fighter. But we don't need to worry about him again. We have Commander Video! gentlemen for sure now maybe even the overlord wait this is strange the superhero's presence is still here the strongest overlord is no more don't tell me he gets to revive too what an annoying hero the strongest overlord is oh, maybe the superhero is attached to his heart like sir mao's father was what happened here? What's he got to hold on to? A resident who doesn't pay rent needs to be kicked out! Wait, he revived, but it seems like he's completely lost the will to fight. I thought the superhero was more of a cool guy. This is kind of disappointing. The strongest overlord is no more. Without the overlord, I am... I am... I am a hero. Where is the next Overlord? Are there no more anywhere? Are there no strong Overlords? Where is the strongest Overlord? It looks like he's looking for the strongest Overlord, but Mao's dad is somewhere around here, right? I heard that the superhero went to defeat the strongest Overlord and never returned. It seems that story is wrong. Where is the strongest Overlord? Dad. Now, why the gloomy face? It seems I can't trust others after all. Friends are useless to me. He remembered. Huh? What's wrong now? The superhero has taught me a lesson. A trusting heart, promises, friends. They're all useless. Where do you think you're going? I no longer have any business here. I'm going home. Watching him makes me sick. You guys better pack it up and leave. Otherwise, I'll consider you parasites and sick my defenses on you. This is bad. Mao's heart has become suddenly hard. It's as hard as weak old bread. His heart was finally starting to be honest, too. What happened? Ever since he saw the superhero, he started acting strange. But what's the connection between Mao and the superhero? I haven't heard any rumors. There are games and comics and cartoons of the superhero in Mao's room. So I wonder if that has to do with it. Do you think this could somehow be related to his heart scar? The heart scar seems to be what darkens Mao's heart like a burnt crust that sticks to the bottom of the pot. Which means Sir Mao must have met superhero Orum sometime in the past. Say, Hero, what's the real superhero like? Would he really hurt Mao's heart? The guy we just saw was pretty weird. Is the real one like that too? Sir Orem is super famous in the human world, and he's a legendary hero that everyone admires. He's the strongest, smartest, nicest, most competent, and even pretty funny hero ever. He's perfect in every way. He's mentioned as a top-class hero in our kingdom's annals as well. Though he is a man from the distant past, he left the human world to defeat the strongest overlord. I believe it's been more than 200 years since then. But his many adventures are retold as legends, and he's even on the coins and bills of the kingdom's currency. I have all his games, cartoons, comics, novels, figures, even the diecast ones, and even some fan magazines. Wow, you're a fanatic. But even normal people know who the superhero is. 
That's how great of a man he was. But that superhero we saw would never be mistaken for a role model for badasses everywhere. The real Sir Orm is different. He's a man of courage and justice, and he beat many evil overlords and gods. Even the overlord was pretty different from the overlord inside his heart. No way could that be the real Sir Orm. But from Mal's point of view, that's how he appeared, right? Well, maybe. There's a problem. Why did the superhero reflect so badly in Sir Mal's eyes like that? Debating over the menu won't fill your stomachs. If you have time to think, then cook! You're young! Move forward! You're right, Master. This is fine for now. Some do only become clear when the time is just right. Just don't forget that when it's time, we are the only ones who will be there to support Mao. Time for an Omake segment. It's Meow and Sis. Okay. Oh, hello, Salvatore. Are you being foreshadowed for us? How nice of you. <laughs> the superhero is of little concern. He may have been strong, but what can one do when they cease to exist? I only obey my evil mind and walk forward down my own path. We're going to attack the senior classrooms. We need to go repay that Lady of the Dias, gentlemen. But we still don't know where they are. That is nothing to worry about. I thought this might happen, so I've discovered their location. That sounds really awkwardly worded there, Jeffrey. Uh, can't talk. Oh, it's amazing how no one knows where they are, yet you were able to find them. So, where are they? Directly above us. Above? Oh, I see. The classrooms flew down here. Yes, and they will land shortly. Oh, come on! I was joking! <laughs> Alma is confirmed for Raukau. They most likely use the class bells to time their raids. That way they can disappear right after a fight. I sure do like my climate at a 90 degree angle. <laughs> I never thought of that. <laughs> their methods are more advanced than regular badasses. Legend has it, seniors were originally a group of super honor students. Now that they're delinquents, this won't be easy. Don't forget that there are brainwashed freshmen being held in their classrooms. Oh, that's right. I completely forgot. Go ahead and forget them. Now that I've reached my potential, I don't need servants. As long as I have this evil power and brain, the day I beat up my dad quickly approaches. <laughs> he seems to be in a good mood. I know there has to be a pitfall just waiting for us. Okay. That sure was a set of cutscenes. But I think it is time to end things off here. So, thank you all for watching. If you like my video, feel free to subscribe and stuff. And I will see you guys later. Yeah, reach over here to push the button. Because setups. <laughs> you know, it's a thing. See y'all.